everyone and welcome to or welcome back to Nora's Code. I'm Yoshida and here at The Code, we like I like to plan my life minimally and functionally using a planner. Also, I love to budget plan and plan my budget so that I can get my life on track. I am a self-employed hairstylist if you're new here, so my um, income is inconsistent. So, but today I wanted to show you guys our paycheck budget um, notepad that came in our June box. I'm thinking of using that today, which I think I will. But let's go and see what we have to do this uh, week. Um, today is Wednesday. No, today is Tuesday, uh, July 4th. I do like to keep my budget here in my planner because um, I like to just give it a flip and see. You know what I'll do? I'm not going to use this. I would like to use this for pre-planning um, for next week maybe. But I want to stick with this because I like to just flip and review uh, last week. So this was last week. I don't know. Oh, I did pay PayPal. Um, GoDaddy, I don't recall seeing that come out of my bank account. A lot of things are being held up in my bank account. Um, we're paying car insurance this week. Um, firm got paid after pay, after pay, after pay. So firm. Um, my booth ring got paid. Amazon, I don't recall seeing that. It probably came out. Um, I'm just going to put an asterisk here and I'll check for that. CMP came out and it's like $47.69. Uh, community, I did pay them. I gave them 30 and also, I found out that Ulta was not due to the 17th, but I went ahead and paid it. It should be coming out this week. And then another afterpay came out on Saturday. So those things got paid. I knew that, let's see, car insurance wouldn't get paid that week. So everything worked out. Norris Cove, I don't know the exact number to me because my subscriptions come in on the first, but by the first being a Saturday, I don't get paid for those until this week, um, which we've already paid for some items. So, uh, let's see. Um, I don't know. We did a little over a hundred. I'm going to keep it at a hundred because I had some invoices that were paid. We're just going to leave that there. Um, hair. Let's see what we did last week. One second. Okay. Um, did I do any totals for last week? Okay, yeah, so I divided it up. So here, for the month of June, we did $4,968. For the week, we did $1,190. So I was close. Okay, so, and then I did get gas. Didn't give Capital One anything. I gotta try to work on them. I did make it to Hell's Kitchen. You all probably um, heard me talk about that. I did make it to Hell's Kitchen. I had enough left over to go there. And my aunt did treat me to some drinks. So, um, let's hop into this week. This week is July 7th, I mean, excuse me, July 3rd through July 9th. This week is a very short week for me. I'll be out of town. I'm only working two days this week. Um, and then we have Norris Cove, which I label No Cove, and Miscellaneous. So for hair, I, y'all, I'm gonna put it at, I think I'm reaching if I say 700, but I'm gonna put it at about uh, 650. Again, because I'm only working two days. Um, no Cove. Uh, we are going to be at about 800 And then part of that is I know it's going to a loan. And then miscellaneous, I don't expect anything. And let's do some bills. So, again, we got a lot going on. So, I'm whipping out my personal. Actually, here's, I have it on our sticky note. These also came in our um, June box. Um, these were originally in... Let's make sure. Yeah. Yeah. These were originally in our first box, which was our November box. But I brought them back for the month of June in taupe. And we have plenty of these opposed to having to, because we kept going out of stock. So I'm going to use this. That's kind of like my pre plan as well. Um, so on the third, we had a firm. And that was paid. Um, Ulta. Again, I didn't have to pay Ulta. I'm putting the 17th, but 
I went ahead and paid it because I'm so used to it being on the second. And I just didn't want to be late. Community, I know I gave them 30. I can go ahead and check those off. And Walmart is actually due today. Oh my God, I need to pay them. Uh, Walmart, it's normally $28. I just did 30. I'll pay them. Uh, we have a firm. Y'all, like, what is going on, Yoshida? But they got me in a chokehold. I'm, I'm working my way loose. <laughs> okay, and then I have Apple. That's $2.99. That's like storage. And on the 5th is... Am I coming up? Okay. On the 5th, we have Credit One. <sighs> These... I look at these credit cards. I'm like, these were some dumb credit cards that I got. Um, a firm again on the six. Oh, we have a okay. I was thinking about my bank again. I was like, do I got nothing here to cover all of this? And I do 38.96. And we had money left over from last week, which I should put here. So let me put that here. We had about a hundred dollars left from last week. Um, a firm corner. <laughs> I'm gonna play corner off because it's only thirty dollars. See, here I have that corner. The balance is only thirty dollars and seventy two cent, but it's fifteen thirty six. So I'm gonna put the fifteen thirty six because if I don't get to that bill before they take it out, they'll just take this fifteen thirty six out, and then I'll just pay the remaining. Um, on the six, I'm gonna pay State Farm. And that's four sixty-five. This keeps adjusting, but I'm kind of scared to switch to another insurance company, so I'm just gonna stick with them. Um, InDesign, that's my design and software um, for inserts and stuff like that. Um, that's two twenty-two sixty-five. I really, I, I'm still working, learning it, but I have another one that I use. I have two more that I use. But I'm still learning this one. So what I'll do is I'm going to be designing this one, resizing the other, and then I switch things over to Canva to get the cut lines. I know it's crazy. Um, it's just crazy. But anyway, um, and then we have Afterpay on the 9th. So anything else? Um, I'll probably end up getting gas. But then again, I don't know because I got a little bit of gas left before we go out of town, which is Thursday. Um, I'm going to leave gas alone over here. I'm putting capital one and then I have to start saving. I have to move my T-Mobile bill to a checking account now because, um, they no longer want to take it out of your credit cards. Like they're saying they're stopping that. So that messed that up. But anyway, we want to, I'm just putting this here. This not, this does not mean that I'm going to pay this. It's just for me. To have like you know something to draw my eye to it and i don't think oh travel days traveling so i'll be helping my husband with gas so i'll put that here i'm gonna stick this back and then we're going to so put that there let's do our math Okay, you guys, so we have $733.09 to come up with this week. And I realized when I got to the bottom that I forgot to put the amount in for the last afterpay, which is $28.84. So we need this amount for bills this week. We'll put that here, $733.09. And let's do some math here. So we have a total of $1,550 here. Now, again, for those who are new, again, I'm self-employed. So I need to highlight this, to highlight this. I kind of want to stay in color. Let's see. 
so this is what I'm guesstimating. This is again on the low, in between the low and the high range of what I can make this week. It may be more. So if it's more, I like to either pay down debt or do something else with it. Um, we will be traveling this week, so I know that I will not um, be paying any debt down with that. Maybe, maybe not. Normally, what I make from Norris Cove go back into the business. But because I've paid ahead of some things, I'm going to pay myself back this time. Um, so we got fifteen fifty minus seven three. Let's, let's leave it at seven thirty-three. That leaves eight hundred and seventeen dollars left, um, which is pretty much Norris Cove. Um, and then I do need to get some things for Norris Cove, so I can put down here business expenses. Just a few things, and I've already done the um, math on it, and it's not going to be that much. So, well, let me put that here. Business expense. So, that's that, y'all. What I need to get is probably roughly about four or five hundred dollars. So that still will leave me a couple of dollars to put towards, you know, pay myself back, which works out. So finally, I'm kind of coming up, <laughs> making a profit. Very little profit, but still a profit. So that's all that I have for you guys this week. Um, again, if you are new here, you can find these inserts in my shop. Um, the link is listed below. These are the Paycheck Budget Tote. We all, these also come in plain if you're just not a person who likes to have color in your um, budget. And you can take the clear or the plain and customize it to the color that you like or just leave it simple. I was a plain girl, but my customers love the taupe and I've just kind of fallen in love with taupe. Um, but yeah, you can find those. You can also find these. We have a few of these left. Um, again, these were in our June box and then our to pay uh, taupe sticky notes. These were also there. So thank you all so much for watching. Again, if today was your first time watching any of my videos and you enjoyed today's video, please do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell and leave me a comment in the comment section. Let me know that you're new here so that I can welcome you to the Cove. All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.